around Jharkhand Chief Minister Himan Sorain after the Chief Minister was untraceable yesterday at his uh, Delhi residence where the ED had reached. The ED team searched uh, one of the vehicles which uh, is used by Himan Sorain in the national capital. ED has now seized the BMW vehicle as the Jharkhand Chief Minister's whereabouts are still unclear. According to top sources in the ED, the car is an asset from the proceeds of crime and sources also tell CNN News 18 that the last known location of Himan Sorain is the premises of a senior advocate. His cavalcade crossed Charkhand Bhavan uh, yesterday, but uh, there was no trace of the chief minister. Although the chief minister's office in Charkhand has confirmed that Heman Sorain will be appearing before the ED uh, for the investigation on January 31st, citing Sorain's earlier letter to the ED. On the other hand, the JMM has issued a statement saying that ED officers had reached Heman Sorain's residence in Delhi in the wee hours of January 29 with many armed personnel which did not seem as per the law. This is what the JMM has said and uh, on the other hand BJP has upped the ante against Sorain saying that uh, he is running like a thief and he has left the state of Charkhand to the mercy of gods. The visuals that you are seeing on your screens right now uh, is of the enforcement directed who was at the uh, who was at the residence of Heyman Sorain. This is the vehicle, one of the vehicles which has just been checked by the enforcement directorate. All the gates ha had been opened and in fact the people that you are seeing on your screen right now are the people from the enforcement directorate. It is being said that this is one of the vehicles which was being used by the Chief Minister Heyman Sorain. In fact, this vehicle was absolutely frisked by the salutes of, uh, of enforcement directorate. On the other hand, the team of enforcement directorate is yet again returning back to the, res uh, to the residence of, of the CM. Remember, at, at approximately 7 a.m. this morning was the time when the team of enforcement directed had reached out here and post that they had started to search. In fact, there still is no absolutely zero clarity as to where is Heyman Sorain. The enforcement director's sources have told us that they will wait over here until and unless Heyman Sorain turns up. Now, where will Heyman Sorain turn up? That is a big, big question at this point in time. On the other hand, there are hectic parlays that have already started in the state of Jharkhand. But yes, the million dollar question still remains. Where is Heyman Sorain? And that question has still not been answered by the GMM or by the CM office and hence the enforcement director is still waiting for Heyman, so uh, Heyman Surin to turn up in front of them and answer the questions that needs to be confronted with him because remember the enforcement director has very very clearly stated that they have found some new evidences, some new documents that needs urgent confrontation with the CM uh, regarding the land scam that is alleged land scam that is being investigated by the premier agencies. Deki, jo media में चल रहा है वो सच नहीं है और जिस तरह की अफवाहें फैलाई जा रही है कहीं न कहीं झारखंड सरकार को अस्थिर करना यहां लॉ एंड ऑर्डर की समस्या खड़ी करना इनके नियत में है जानबूझ करके इस तरह के फीड्स दिए जा रहे हैं कि मुख्यमंत्री जी लापता हैं मुख्यमंत्री जी फरार हैं जब मुख्यमंत्री जी ने ऑलरेडी टाइम ले लिया है 31 तारीख का ईडी से फिर इस तरह की खबरें आ रही है तो हम समझते हैं कि पूर्णतः गलत है और ये जानबूझ करके इस तरह की खबरें फैलाई जा रही है ताकि पूरे राज्य में एक अफरा तफरी का माहौल हो दिस इज अ गेसो आर्क व्हाट यू आर सेइंग बट ईडी गॉट इट्स ओन ड्यूटी टू परफॉर्म एंड आई पर्सनली फील पार्टी शुड नॉट इन्वॉल्व in this type of uh, actions, a party should not be involved. This is creating unnecessary tension between the two political parties. That is not required. Uh, I will tell you one thing always. Nobody is above the law. We should not create a situation so that uh, we can become bigger person than the law. राजनीतिक परिस्थिति को जिस प्रकार से पेश किया जा रहा है यह लोकतांत्रिक मूल्यों के खिलाफ है हम तो सर्वदा इस बात को कहते हैं हमसे जो भी राजनीतिक मतभेद है उस पर लोगों के बीच जाइए लोगों के बीच तो आप जा नहीं सकते 
इसलिए आप अपनी एजेंसी को आगे कर रहे हैं जिस केस का जिक्र हो रहा है वो सरकारी रिकॉर्ड में भूयरी दर्ज है 